Hi Cancer, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Cancer, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Cancer. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the temperance, and this is Sagittarius energy. So this is a card of patience. This is a card of self-restraint, control, self-control. There's this feeling of trying to do the right thing, kind of like walking the middle, the middle path, being balanced and taking a gentle approach to something. There's also a healing energy as well as like a, a reconciliation energy. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the Ten of Pentacles, Earth energy. The lovers, Gemini energy, and the five of pentacles, earth energy. So with the five of pentacles, someone could have abandoned you or left you out or walked away in some way. There's this feeling of being left out in the cold or, you know, feeling lonely, feeling neglected, feeling like you're not good enough. There's this feeling of, you know, this abandon. I'm seeing abandonment or rejection with the five of pentacles. This person, it does look like... Um, there was a feeling of indecision. They could have had to choose between you and someone else. Perhaps they had to choose between you and their family or someone they had a family with. Um, there's just this feeling of choices having to be made and someone having either made the wrong decision or have had the, perhaps they didn't make a decision and that felt like a rejection. There's this feeling with the temperance that you will be reconnecting with this person. They've taken time. There's a matured approach. There's this feeling of coming towards you with a more sober mind, a more matured energy. And there's this opportunity to reconnect and to find some sort of balance in the situation. So let's clarify these cards on Cancer. Okay, we have the two of pentacles and this is earth energy virgo taurus capricorn energy so there's again this like this person was juggling you with something else or someone else there's something about them having had to make a decision and they they wavered they hesitated they went back and forth about something okay so let's see okay we have the lovers gemini energy the seven of pentacles earth energy and the seven of swords in the reverse air energy so with the, the lovers, there's again this feeling of a choice, a decision need, needing to be made. The connection they share with you is very strong. It's very intense. It's powerful. In fact, with the lovers, it can even feel like a soulmate connection. It's, it's one that's felt on a soul level. This person could connect with you in dreams. There could be some sort of telepathic connection here. They, they feel it very strongly. But there's something else that is pulling their energy. And it looks like something practical, something... Um, something like work or something that they are obligated to something like a responsibility of some sort so this person has a difficult time prioritizing this connection and at times it looks like at some point they may have even tried to reject the connection but they couldn't you know this is someone who can't it's like they can't escape this connection it's very intense for them and they feel like it's meant for like it's on a soul level they recognize that and um, with the seven of swords that can be again someone who tried to escape someone who tried to walk away but with it being in the reverse it's like they couldn't they they couldn't leave you behind they couldn't replace you and there's this feeling of returning to you um, with the seven of pentacles being here it does look like it will this is a situation that's going to progress very slowly but there's a goal here to to bring healing to the situation it does look like they may want to open up and discuss something with you. They want to be vulnerable with you. They want to be honest. There's some sort of confession coming from this person. But with the Seven of Pentacles, there's still a lot of uh, almost like doubts or hesitancy. 
this is someone who's not sure of where things are going to go but they do know that their heart is here with you but it does look like a very complicated situation for this person okay so i'm going to pull out an oracle card for you cancer have surrendered to the divine full moon so there's a divine connection here and this person at times they find themselves wanting to surrender to it but at the same time there's something else something like a responsibility that they have that kind of distracts them or makes it difficult for them to fully give themselves to this connection in the 3d um, there is a message here though about having to surrender to something something is going to come full circle it does look like you will reconcile with this person and there's some some sort of epiphany that's happening here or some sort of mutual understanding okay so i'm gonna plot another card for you cancel okay we have made the effort great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take so someone could be considering making the effort here it's like, this is worth it. This is real love. And this is something that they will never be able to replace or replicate. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you. we have playfulness play is the royal road to childhood happiness and adult brilliance so there could be something about the connection that's very healing and nurturing to your inner child this could be for both people here it's like this is a connection that feels more like an escape from something that's very mundane for this person okay so i'm gonna pull out a card for your advice um cancer Okay, we have surrender unhealthy relationships. Let go of relationships that don't serve you, including unavailable or toxic people. You deserve to be treasured by others and to be surrounded by positive people. So that's the advice for you, Cancer. I hope you have a really, really good day, Cancer. Bye, Cancer.